Hello everyone, we're out in the field today. We are hooked up to this truck right here. It's a 2008 Cummins ISM. And we're gonna show you how the regen command works in the Texa. So let's go back here to the Texa. I know it's gonna be a little sunny out here, a little hard to see. But there's our command, particular filter regeneration. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna select it. And then I'm gonna go down here to the start button and give it a hit. Try changing everything here a little bit so you can see a little better. So basically now it's gonna ask you some questions. Uh, let's make sure the PTO and cruise switch are off. It's warning you how hot it's going to get. Don't get anywhere near it, so you up to 1400 degrees. Make sure we're neutral on the parking brake on. Step away from the engine compartment. And now it says wait. So what we're going to see here in a second, and I'll shift that back, is this truck right here is going to rev up, and you'll hear it here in a second. It takes about 30 seconds. There we go. You can hear the truck revving up. Right? Things are going. So you'll notice on our chart here, the graph starts going up, and this is the uh, temperature of the DPF filter climbing. That's what the red is. I go over down here to the bottom. If I can find my mouse on the screen, there's this little blue arrow right here I'm trying to get to. If you click that, it'll give you tables of the regen commands. And I can hit that little button again, and it goes back to the chart. So that's how you kind of watch everything going on. Because obviously if you have a problem, you want to be able to be watching and seeing everything going on. So there's all the sensor values. I can scroll through them. There's a whole bunch of them there. But there we are, doing a regen on the Cummins. Going well. I'm going to hit the cancel button so we don't want to sit here and do one. Cancel. And you can hear the engine rev down. And we're back to idle. So there it is, force regen on a Cummins with the Texa Diagnostic Tool. Thank you for watching.